afternoon and welcome one and all. You join us for this 2020 match between India and Zimbabwe. I'm Mike Atherton and alongside me today is Ali Mitchell and the dashing David Gower. Thanks, Mike. Always a pleasure to sit alongside you. I've just been taking a look at conditions down in the middle and it really does look like having a bowl will be the correct move and hope you can chase down anything the opposition posts. Gorgeous clear weather and no threat of any rain. Great information there from David Gower. It's time for the toss. Let's join them pitch side to see who'll be batting first. Well, showing a lot of faith in this batting lineup, going first on this pitch is either a masterstroke or a disaster waiting to happen. Signals that we're ready to go. First ball of the innings about to be bowled. Wait. Couldn't get it through the field. Looking to get the inning started, just can't get it away. Big edge. Let's see if they can get the ball up into the slot like before. So crucial to follow up that last delivery and keep the batter under pressure. Oh, nice bowling. Completely mistimed it. Didn't look like they got anywhere near that. Brilliant bowling. Having got the edge the previous ball, they now know the areas they need to be hitting. Time to keep the pressure on now. Great last ball to find the edge. It's just a case of finding the same spot. Wait. Quick onto that in the infield. Maybe they didn't pick it up. Very late on the shot. Keeper. Got forward well and was able to drive the ball. A lovely shot and good running. Over. Zimbabwe are one for none. Going with pace now. No runs on that occasion, got into position nicely just too early on the shot, couldn't find a gap. Yep, yep. Doesn't beat the infield. There'll be one run here for them. A new batter always likes to feel bat on ball early on as they bring a bit of energy to the crease. Yep. There's a run here, surely. Well, they decided against the run. Not sure why, if I'm being honest. They'd have made it very comfortably. Yes. That's great fielding. That ball was flying. Really raced between the wickets after it was clipped away nicely behind square. Wait.
Wait on. Yep, yep. Exquisitely down the front foot, a gorgeous looking drive. Could have been worth more. Three added in that over. Zimbabwe are four for none. In the air, looks to be landing safely. Found the middle of the bat, great timing. Lovely front foot shots that's raced to the boundary. A boundary off the last ball. Is it a sign they're trying to push the run rate? on the drive. Yes, nice bowling. Just need to settle down. The timing's all off. These deliveries are there to be hit. Just got to keep a cool head. Wait. Finds the fielder with that shot. Well, not a great delivery. Got it full. Lucky not to be hit to the boundary. Good. Not sure anyone is going to cut that off. Well, that was a very solid shot. Read the length early to get onto the front foot, and that raced away for four. Boundary off the last ball. What's to come off this delivery, I wonder? Drives and misses everything. Nice. Well, that's a wild one. Nothing elegant about that shot, just not timing it at all. Poor play. Yes! Out! Yeah. Trudge back to the pavilion. A disappointing display in the end for someone with such batting skills. This one goes down as a fail. The field will come up now, you'd think. Pressure should definitely be on the new batter, who strides to the middle. They will be looking for another quick wicket. Bowl disturbs the furniture. An innings that promised much and really, in the end, delivered very little. Pretty disappointing all round. Difficult period as they come to the wicket. They'll take plenty of time to set themselves up before facing their first ball. Obviously didn't like the look of that one and just ignored it.